Thank you, Shanika. Another day of extreme heat and high temperatures. Today, we could see the triple digits again. Yeah, we've got tips on how to stay safe and uh, also cool. DC News Now's Jean Marie Sisse is live in Montgomery County. And Jean Marie, the, uh, the county rather, is under a heat emergency alert. Yeah, Montgomery County is definitely under a heat emergency alert. It went into effect yesterday and goes up until Wednesday night. They are expecting a heat index of about 105 degrees over two days or more. Now, at this moment, it's currently about 78 degrees right here in Silver Spring, about three degrees in about an hour ago. That's a three degree increase compared to an hour ago. Definitely starting to get extremely hot and a little humid around the area. I definitely got my handy dandy fan to keep me cool this morning. And we also have some safety tips to make sure that you stay cool throughout the day today as well. Now, with this extreme heat, that also means that there will impact your body's temperature to help regulate that. So we also want to make sure that there are also an increase of chance when it comes to heat illnesses. So what can you do to stay safe? Well, you want to make sure that you're staying indoors. Try to keep your blinds or curtains closed. Take a cool bath or shower to help keep your body temperature down and cool off. Make sure you avoid strenuous activities that could cause overexposure or you can actually go during the coolest part of the day, which is now during the morning time and take breaks in the shade as much as possible. Stay hydrated as much as you can. And the one person that we spoke to today that was on their way to work says the past couple of days, the heat has been a lot and he's not looking forward to today. The heat's been very oppressive. You know, it's really very uncomfortable. I am hoping it cools down really soon. Now, the Montgomery County Health Department is passing out tabletop fans to those to the elderly and also those with disabilities. So if you are interested in getting one, there is a limited supply, but you can find more inf information on our website, dcnewsnow.com. For now, I'm going to try my best to stay cool while I'm out here this morning, and I hope you guys do as well later on today. For now, reporting live in Silver Spring, I'm Yamarisa Say, DC News Now.